back of that. Let's check in on how bond markets are trading though. Simon Michelle joining us live from Fix Securities. Simon, one well, welcome to the program. Everyone, obviously, post Brexit sort of piling into safe haven assets. What sort of demand are you seeing at the moment in the bond market? Yeah, good afternoon, Leanne. Well, uh, here in Australia, we've actually seen yields bounce up a little bit uh, from those levels we reached on Friday. All-time lows, the 10-year reaching 2%, up about four basis points, I think. So that give, might give us a bit of an indication of what we're likely to see as uh, London and the US come on board for Monday. Yeah, OK. So everyone's sort of now wondering what next. I mean, where, where are these yields going? Absolutely. And we're certainly seeing that. I mean, still very, very low yields, um, you know, still very much at that low end. I mean, over in the US, for example, you know, down... Uh, to new territory over there as well. We haven't seen the US 10-year this low since July 2012, so four years ago. It really took a little bit of uh, pressure off onto the RBA uh, for a future rate cut. We're see certainly seeing that priced in. If you're looking at the US Fed, the likelihood that they'll increase this year has gone from 75% um, down to about 15% chance in this environment. So some real uh, interesting repricing going on at yeah, the moment. Yeah, absolutely. Of course, we know we have the RBA meeting happening next week. What's the sort of pricing pricing there? Are we seeing that increasing maybe for, for a rate cut next week? It certainly has, absolutely. And we're definitely seeing the two-year down there, you know, really, really low now, down around 1.58%, a cash rate of 1.75. So definitely suggesting we're likely to see lower rates. Obviously, given last week, it'd be really interesting to see uh, what commentary we get from the RBA on the back of that uh, rate decision on Tuesday. Yeah, it will, very, will be very, very interesting. Simon, we'll leave it there. Really appreciate your time. Thank you.